All right, guys, I am going to be making this a really short video. Uh, I got to put my face cam on. Hi. Anyways, I am going to be the first thing I'm going to be doing when I get Dragon Ball Sparking Zero in two weeks from now is I'm going to be recreating the following fight from Dragon Ball Super. Let me just adjust my um, camera. I don't really need microphone adjustment. Essentially, what I'm going to do is I'm going to react to like the first part of this fight. I know what happens after essentially what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to go i'm going to be watching this entire fight and this is only one section it doesn't go all the way to the end like this entire if this was the last part all the way it would be like two something minutes uh what i'm going to do is i'm just going to watch this and analyze it and see what i can possibly do with i don't know what i'm saying i'm going to analyze and see what kind of moves i can use obviously i got to watch the tutorials on this game and I will have the music off because I don't want to get copyrighted. So I will not have copyrighted music. I uh, If you see any wind sound effects, I, I my door's open. I got to close that as soon as I can. I don't want to close it. You know what I will? That was cringe, but I guess we'll analyze and see how this works out. So I will be going mechanic by mechanic. So this will be boost. So Broly is raging, is going for Gogeta. So... Um, Broly goes boost. I jump as Gogeta. I try. I don't know if I can do something like that, like this move, or maybe even this move. But after I get that move, we both fly away from each. We both fly away from each other. No, we first separate ourselves. I don't know if that's. I don't know if that move is possible. I mean, this is a cool shot. This right here is a cool shot. I don't know how I'm going to be able to pull this off, but in some area, okay. Um. Okay. Go back go back not this is a cool part but around here around here and this is where he boosts uh, this is where i use the boost i don't know how i can use like the beam uh let me let me quickly go back like this beam right here i don't know how it's possible but obviously like yeah yeah, yeah. i don't know how you can do the beam and then and then those again i don't know if i can do that i'll just maybe i'll just make like some green screen effects but that's a bad idea Gogeta continues to beat him up. Gogeta continues to beat him up. If I can just play this at like, wait, can I? Yeah, I can play this at double speed, but I'm not going to have, obviously I'm not going to have video video audio. Anyways, um, they clash. And uh, around this point, I should be using the meteor explosion. It's not the ultimate attack. I don't know what to do for this scene. Maybe I'll skip it. And this should be like one of those clashes where I don't understand where... I, it's one of those clashes if you look on the sparking zero website there's a lot of websites for this game that cover it but if you look on the bandai namco website which is like i don't know what i'm saying um the, i know exactly what it can do with this but this next part is kind of a hassle because because it's obviously a volcano there's fire there's like lava everywhere now and uh, I don't know if I can do that, but Planet Namek Destroyed is one of the locales available. We might have more than six um, in the final release. I've always seen like six in the demos I've seen on YouTube and whatnot. And speaking of that, um, I will be bobbing him. He will fly away. I will boost, and then I will indeed go for the Meteor Explosion. By this point, I will be doing this. Okay, punch to the stomach, pretty much. It looks kind of weird. And then I just let the animations play out. And after, uh, that's pretty much like the video because it cuts off. Um, let me quit. It cuts off right here. This is part of where it cuts on. Or off, I should say. So, um, Gojini uses the ultimate combat high and then I'll stop it there. So, um, this is, this was a really short video. I'm really sorry if it was really short and unedited. And with no music, it just makes things a lot worse. But that's probably the first thing I'm going to be doing at Sparking Zero. So um, um, it's going to be a hassle, but I think I can do it. But I need your guys' help to do this. Um, so um, I, if you guys want to help me, contact me on Discord. It's just NGPG. Uh, you can uh, friend request me on Discord. I'll make like a little group chat with some people who want to help me. I, I'm in a couple Discord servers for this game. And they do indeed have some people that might want to do this with me. So, um, I guess, I don't know what I'm saying. Like right here. I also have a ready post. Anyways, we really appreciate you guys for watching this. I have a lot of aspirations for this game. It's going to be so fun.
This game is going to be so, so fun to grind. And just, yeah. I will see you when... I'm not sure what I'm going to do upon the game. I don't know when the game initially releases. Because I didn't get the Deluxe Edition. I'm going to get it on October 11th. But I pre-ordered it. So um, I pre-ordered it mainly for the reason I can make that fight. Because a pre-order bonus, you unlock the Daima Goku, which is for Dragon Ball Diamond. That's coming soon. The same day as um, Spark and Zero. <gasps> and you also get all three Super Gogetas and all three Super Brolies. And what I mean by that is they're from the movie that this fight's in. And that's... Yeah. I uh, really hope you guys enjoyed my aspirations for this game. Um, once again, if you want to wanna help me right here, NGPG. Yeah, that, that's pretty much it. Um, I, I've said that's pretty much it like three times, maybe even four. So um, I'll see you in whatever video I make when Spark and Zero comes out, namely the remake.